Definitely, I'll tell you all about my team. So uh, Lee Armstrong, nicknamed Army or Leeski, uh, is super forgetful and uh, she's actually lost a team jacket twice and had to rebuy it a third time because she loses everything. And it's charming and now we love it. And now that she's pregnant, it's getting a bit worse, but we love her. Um, myself, they call me Murky. I tend to be um, pretty hyper, I drink a lot of coffee. And um, Joanne Rizzo, her nickname is Pokey because she tends to be a little slow and late uh, often. And for Skipper, Sherry, um, Sherry's just Sherry. We help her with fashion and um, just all in all, we're just like four peas in a pod. been curling for five years now together and uh, we originally formed to take a good run at the Olympic trials for Sochi and we lost the finals in last year's Roar of the Rings to Jennifer Jones's team so the trials is a great example we went 0-3 and, and everyone wrote us right off and we ended up winning the tiebreaker and rolling through the semi against Holman, which was probably our best game that we've ever played together. And we were just so excited to be in that final against Jones and feeling good about it. And after such a hard loss, we kind of came together and we're still having a lot of fun on the ice, still getting along, having a lot of success. So we're still giving it our best out here on tour. Our goal from the first get-go, from our sit-down chat after last year's season was over, our main focus was the Scotties. That's been another hurdle of our team. We haven't gotten to the Scotties. I mean, I've been there. The girls have dreamed about it. And I mean, it's, it's not far off, but to wear the Ontario crest and then get to the Scotties and then of course wear the Maple Leaf. And I mean, you, you always want to wear the Maple Leaf, but you realize that there are steps to get there. Yeah, as a team, I think we, we strive to be in that final game, whether it's in a slam or in a playdowns or in a normal tournament. We tend to be consistently um, around on Sunday, if you know what I mean. Like we tend to be always qualifying and, and whether or not we make the final in these high profile events, it's been more often than not. This game tests your patience a lot. Um, the fact that we get along so well on and off the ice is a reassuring fact. The curling teams, you see them so close because that is part of your, your family cycle or your friends. I mean, we are basically, we're together how much over the summer from August till April and we don't see a lot of our family, so we become our own family. You have to want to get together with the same four people every weekend and grind it out and still have a good time. I mean, it's easy to stay together. Um, I know some teams have been mixing things up, but I couldn't dream about curling with anyone else. Sherry is a mix, I think the perfect mix of uh, business, social, and just a fearless leader out on the ice. And she's not afraid to tell us when, you know, we've screwed up and we'll do better for her because ultimately it's our job to make sure she feels confident. Yeah, I'm the leader and, and my team is looking for me to make that last shot. And there is a lot of pressure, but you know what, it's a fun pressure and I've chosen this position. Uh, sometimes when you're standing behind the house and you're watching rocks come at you and you see your three other teammates down there joking and you feel kind of out of the loop, but you know what? It is what it is and I've been a skip for a number of years and if anyone's seen me sweep, <laughs> there's no other position I could play. I am a horrible sweeper, so I am where I am because of my talent and that would be lack of sweeping. <laughs> Sherry is a born skip. She's a born leader. She's a bit stubborn sometimes, but that's okay because she knows what she wants and she's obviously had a really successful curling career. We're there to help. It's a team game and we do better when we all work together, but she's a great skip. I think with our team, it's pretty much you see is what you get. Um, the front end's pretty light, keeps it light. Sherry can be serious on the ice, but that's her job and pretty light off the ice. I'm hoping I'm doing a good job at Vice, kind of being the glue that, you know, connects the two ends together. We're doing all the right things, it's just 
having the four of us perform at the same time at a high level because you have to. You're playing against the best of the best day in, day out, and so you have to be physically ready, you have to be mentally ready, and put the skill out there, and we have it. It's just a matter of putting it all together.